what I got for Christmas 2020. That's what this video is. Uh, well, it's not going to have animals in it, probably. Certainly not about the animals, so skip it if that's all you care about. I always enjoy watching these videos from other people. I don't know why it fascinates me, but it does. It's not even like a materialistic thing or jealousy. I don't know. I just really like seeing what people got for Christmas. Um, it's like sharing in their Christmas joy, kind of, I guess. So this is what I got. Um, certainly, of course, always a little disclaimer. I don't even think it's necessary. If you watch the channel enough, you probably know me and know this, but not about the gifts. I love Christmas. I love the traditions. I love the joy. I love obviously not being technically surrounded by friends and family this year, but still just, it just, there's a closeness and it's happy. So uh, I love getting gifts for people, making gifts for people. That probably makes me happier than getting gifts, but um, at the same time, people who, yeah, love me, care about me, went out of their way to get me some really incredible gifts too. So I'm going to show you all of them. And then stay tuned because the next few videos will be all about the pets because you are going to see what the pigs got for Christmas because holy cow, um, they have a huge haul. And then um, the birds have their own what they got for Christmas. We'll see how many I do, but the pigs for sure their video is coming. I hope everyone had a wonderful holiday season. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. Happy December. <laughs> this. Yes, I'm at the age where my number one thing, oh, there's a bulb. Uh, my number one thing on my Christmas list is a vacuum. <laughs> this is not just any vacuum. It is the Bissell Pet Crosswave. I have a lot of animals in my house, <laughs> um, far more than the normal person. And even though I clean and clean and clean and clean, it's hard to stay on top of this many animals. And basically what this vacuum said it does is it vacuums and mops at the same time. And around here, that would mean uh, saving me a couple of hours of work. Uh, all the floors in this house are hardwood. Um, I do have some rugs down, but not many because that's just inviting animals to have accidents on them. Uh, but I used this for the first time and while it requires you to go a little slower than if you were just vacuuming, uh, it still cuts my total amount of work. I would say by more than half because mopping does take a long time. I am pretty happy with it. I got this from my sister. It's the Ring Fit Adventure for Switch. The only game I have on my Switch right now is still uh, just Animal Crossing. So I want to try a few different games. Um, this one looked fun because yeah, you're up and you're like moving around and I, I don't know. Do you guys have any other games that you really like for Switch? Let me know. I prefer, I would say I want to get Mario Kart and Mario Party and all those. Um, but I'm looking for games that are multiplayer. Uh, what is it called? Like couch style multiplayer basically where you only need one console and you play together in the same room. Um, I'm looking at like Overcooked 2 because I love that on my computer. Um, what is it? Rayman. Uh, there's an Unraveled game. I don't know. If you guys have suggestions, let me know. A uh, very interesting gift from Ben uh, was this geode crafting kit. I really like crystals um, and so he just kind of thought it would be fun and silly. Uh, we have not broken them open yet. But yeah, we will uh, take a hammer and <laughs> like a screwdriver, I guess. I don't know. I don't think I want a chisel. And then you just, you crack them open. Just like it's a, and then on the inside is a crystal. I like to put the crystals in my plants. This chicken lamp, ignore This is where the cat was sleeping last night. This chicken lamp and it has smart bulbs so I can turn it on and off. It's in the entryway so I can turn it on and off uh, from my phone, from anywhere. And I really like that. It's really cute. It goes perfect on this entryway table. Of course, I got Starbucks cups. <laughs> so Ben ordered me some. There are cups that you can only get overseas. There's a lot of specifically uh, Asian released cups that I've seen. There's some Mexico cups. Um, I think Australia gets different cups. I don't know, basically, yeah, all over the world. Um, and so he got me a bunch of, I wanna say they're China releases and had them shipped here. Um, so this one, I love this one. 
This is so silly. Just a totally silly materialistic collection. Um, that's just fun for me to try to update. I don't know. Uh, he got me this one, which also has this cute little bunny. This gold one. Um, he'd gotten me, actually, <laughs> he had his brother help get him this one and this one from Germany, I think. Okay, I'm a little bit away. And then that red one. So I have the tall or the venti red and gold and the grande red and gold. So there's the collection so far. Uh, this is like me. Oh, I burned my fingers. This is like maybe half the collection. There's a bunch of matte ones like a white mat and a green mat. There's an oil slick, They're just, you don't care about all this, but there's a, a lot of really pretty ones. Uh, I got this case and carry bag and a mouse for my laptop. Uh, and I also got my laptop. So this was a crazy gift um, <laughs> from my mom and I've, needed it for about two years. It's been on my wish list for <laughs> several years. Um, it just makes editing so much easier for me. I do have a, an Apple desktop um, that I have been using, but that means I'm confined to one room with it. And around here, I really need to be able to be mobile and also uploading. I can now take my computer to faster internet and upload much faster. So I am in my Christmas pajamas. This is incredible. It's the 2019 MacBook Pro and it is an amazing gift. Another really big, really, really needed gift. Um, this, and it's <laughs> fingers crossed everyone that it's gonna work in my quest to be able to live stream. I have not given up. I just have to find a better solution. So this is meant to boost, as it says, boost your phone's signal. Internet is, is out of the question. Uh, the only provider here is the one I have and it's very slow, but I have unlimited data. Unlimited, they say, but you know, there's always a slow down a throttle after a certain point, but my phone does have unlimited data, unlimited hotspotting. So if I can get my signal strong enough and keep it strong enough, um, I might be able to do the live streams using just my phone's internet connection. A very big gift um, and hopefully it's gonna be really amazing for everyone, <laughs> for all of you also. So uh, I really hope it works. Uh, my sister got this, which is probably very smart. It's one of the boot scrapers. This is so silly. Uh, <laughs> things I, I didn't think I'd be excited about for Christmas ever in my life, but uh, we really need this. So yeah, it's a boot scraper, it's a smart gift. I have this plant obsession. I don't know. It, it gets a little crazy, but uh, because of that, and the fact that some pigs the plants are eating, I'm having to get more and more of these wall hanging planters. And so I got this set and it's perfect for like the succulents because it's not really deep and they don't have deep root systems, but also it allows them to drape and hang those three just really clean and then these ones are a little deeper but this set of four they're so pretty and they're going to yeah help me keep my plants safe like i said i love crystals and so um i got these two necklaces with crystals and like the tree of life wrapped around them i got this necklace a whole group of my friends we all have matching ones it's really dainty it's perfect for layering i love wearing yeah small simple jewelry it's just a little little tiny heart with an a on it these duck boots uh which currently have soup cans in them so that they can get bent uh back into shape from shipping i have lots of like rain boots muck boots whatever on the farm and i always end up when they're all the rubber they always end up cracking and stuff right around here probably within the first couple of months um because i get a lot of use i wanted a pair that was going to last longer than that but also a pair that i wouldn't wear on the farm because that's the other thing on the rare occasion that i leave the farm uh in the winter in georgia it's kind of just mucky and rainy and wet uh so i don't necessarily need like winter boots i definitely need boots that are rubber on the bottom. So now when I leave the farm, I'm not in my dirty farm boots. Of course, it's not real leather, nobody panic. Um, also, 
they are lined so they are warmer and really fuzzy i got this aldi candle uh from a friend of mine who knows i love aldi and i love their candles but i'm also cheap and so <laughs> i won't spend more than the 3.99 on their candles um so they came out with these ones that were more expensive because their jars are really pretty and they smell incredible uh so she went ahead and got me one it sits right here on the bar because it's so pretty this absolutely adorable set of bowls that each has a different farm animal pig cow chicken and sheep and baby uh and then on the inside they all have a different pattern also my kitchen is mostly uh becoming like all white things in the cabinets since they are glass cabinets uh yeah i need it all to be kind of pretty and organized <laughs> i feel like so white is definitely yeah, the theme for all my dishes at this point so i loved those um also i got that pig cutting board which is too pretty to use so <laughs> i will just be displaying it in here my sister got me this little pig timer for my stocking <laughs> this is not what i got um but Right now, because of all of the issues with USPS and everything else, um, a lot of gifts are delayed. So it's kind of like Christmas for all of January. Uh, but I know that I'm getting a set of birch logs um, for one of the upstairs fireplaces because, yeah, there are eight fireplaces. And uh, some of them already have these gas inset logs. Um, but... The ones upstairs are all empty, so I'm having to put just fake log sets in those. So I got a really pretty birch set. Flower sack towels. Oh, somebody flipped this one around. Wonder who. Ben, if you're watching this, this is a decorative towel only. Don't put your hands on it. <laughs> um, <laughs> so yeah, these are so cute. Oh, um, also while we're in here, if you watched my Christmas decorations video, um, I've completed this table more now because it's what, I think it's only a couple days after Christmas, but I already put in my after Christmas orders. <laughs> they were like ready to go as soon as everything went on sale. And so, yeah. Um, although this is actually from Amazon because that's where it was cheapest. Yeah, it's coming together more, more complete. This, all the cakes. Again, I love plates. So this sure is perfect. I actually really like the color too. It's not Christmas unless I get at least one little stuffed pig. In my stocking from Andrea, it's a little squishmallow pig. I have a slightly larger version, but this guy's so cute and really squishy and... Doing this one-handed is gonna be, oh, actually it wasn't too bad. It flips. And on the other side, there's a horse. So I was just about to finish editing my What I Got For Christmas video when Ben walks in with my last Christmas present, which is this display case that he made for all of my cups. And he has this little locking system with the straws so that with all these animals running around, they can't knock them over because he said he almost had a heart attack several times. Oh, <laughs> that... yeah, show them where they used to <laughs> I did earlier. Okay. Uh, not the instability of it, I suppose. They all have this circle cut out for the bases and then spot for the straw to go. And then the top shelf is for the grande sizes and the two bottom shelves are for the ventis. 